Cast your mind back to 21st of September 2022, the local community of Huddersfield was left in complete and utter shock and despair when Kyrie McLean was targeted in a pre-planned attack and fatally bladed outside the North Huddersfield Trust School in front of teenagers and parents. Broad daylight. And now a 15-year-old teenager who cannot be named has admitted to being the person responsible at Leeds Crown Court. Now Leeds Court heard the unnamed 15-year-old, along with a 17-year-old co-defendant, had armed themselves with blades, travelled to the school right as Kyrie McLean and his mates had left, and then charged towards them. The prosecutor says before the attack, the 15-year-old killer shouted, Oi Kyrie, or Yo Kyrie, before jumping in the air and thrusting the blade into Kyrie's chest. The metal went through the ribs and damaged the heart and lungs, literally tearing organs. Almost immediately, Kyrie fell to the ground, flat on his back, defenceless, when the unnamed teenager again used the blade on Kyrie for a second time. Miraculously, Kyrie was still able to use his legs, and he kind of pushed out when the teenager tried to strike again. The courts also says that they know that this was a pre-planned attack, because essentially the teenage duo lay in wait for Kyrie. They changed out of their school clothes and also wore balaclavas to conceal their identities, even to the point of wearing sunglasses and they dressed in all black. The duo then went to a wooded area and dumped their clothes and weapons before calmly circling back to the crime scene, watching the air ambulance and the ambulance and the police arrive. Paramedics, a passing doctor and air ambulance staff helped Kyrie before he was transported to Leeds General Infirmary. Sadly, he died 5pm on that same day. Condolences. Stay safe. Safe.